When I first came to Korea, I got nachos once. It came with a side of guacamole and whipped cream, not sour cream. Somebody evidently looked at a picture of nachos and tried to recreate them. When I told the server, hey, this is uh, whipped cream, he went, yeah. This is Migu Gopa and it's half restaurant, half art space. Uh, we do a lot of refurbishing furniture and just making new stuff. All right, today we're starting with the nachos. These are homemade tortilla chips that they make here on site. Well, I guess, is it homemade if it's in a restaurant? Like, does, it, someone would have to... They're homemade. It's, it's homemade, although I don't think this is someone's home. Jalapenos, onions, tomatoes, Mexican cheese, and fresh salsa. And as you can see, it's massive. All this for 15 bucks. Oh, holy crap. Oh, shit. That chip was so heavy, I dropped it. And I lift weights, guys. I lift a lot of weights. I'm a very, like, intensely strong person. As always, my catchphrase, mm, that's really good. I see so many good pieces of furniture that I just put on the side of the road and there's no need for it. So basically I decided to pick them up, make something new and sell them if I could. Today I'm trying the mac and cheese burger. They put macaroni and cheese inside the actual patty and more cheese on top of the patty. It also comes with a huge amount of potato wedges. All this for what, 15 bucks? I'm honestly not gonna be able to finish this. I will anyways and I'll hate myself. I don't know how that got on there. Oh, you're eating the bacon barbecue ranch burger. How does it taste? Mm, yeah, it's really good. It's All right, babe, look, sweet. the show is, I mean, it's my show, so, but no, that's good, thank you. Here's a scenario a lot of people have here in Korea. You spend a whole day chopping wood, for example. You're hungry, you're famished. What do you do? You should come here. You're gonna feel like you accomplished something with your day, and you're gonna feel full in a good way, not full in a bad way, like if you ate a, a box of bullets or something. I don't know, who would do that? If people come here, if they need help painting, refurbishing, putting new materials on different items of furniture, they can bring their stuff here and I can help them if it's not too big. Um, we have a lot of people come here for painting and sketching, just trying to get that creative vibe. It's like after a burger, you just gotta have a cigarette. <sighs> Do you, do you get the? Do you get what I'm saying? Oh. 